A state memorial service for the late Cuban revolutionary leader Fidel Castro was held at Parliament Gardens in Vintuk on Tuesday. Passing on the legacy of the late Fidel Castro requires creating a breeding ground for Namibians who are not passive but vocal about issues both locally and beyond borders, said President of DTA of Namibia, McHenry Vanani. This, he said, is a meaningful way for humans to commit themselves to the better socio-economic circumstances. That the most meaningful way to honor Fidel Castro's life and show our gratitude is by similarly committing ourselves as Namibian leaders and people to bettering the socio-economic circumstances. We should shun corruption, greed, self-idealization and promote the welfare of the Namibian people. Castro died on the 25th of November at the age of 90. Also paying tribute at the memorial service, Swapo Party Secretary General Nangolo Mbumba said Cuba's contribution to Namibia came without any strings attached, a culture that continues to be practiced by Cuba, the Cuban Revolution Party and the Cuban government. But was also inspiration and an inspiration and a symbol of the struggle to all people under colonial domination, like we were. He provided hope to the downtrodden and instilled a sense of selflessness and sacrifice without demanding anything in return.